this is Stampy and welcome back to my let's play of Doki Doki Universe. I hope everyone's doing well today. I am Dandy, thanks for asking. I assumed you asked, I'm assuming you all shouted out at your TV saying how are you doing today Stampy? I'm doing great. I'm looking forward to spending uh, another 20 minutes or so inside the <laughs> crazy crazy world of Doki Doki Universe and I'm going to start off by doing something absolutely crazy which is reading some mail. <laughs> I got two things in my mailbox and if I don't read them now they're all going to build up. Oh, I got a message from Junior, the little snowman. He was the uh, the snowman which um didn't like being cold. <laughs> Told you it's crazy. Dear QT3, I am actually starting to like the cold better. But strangely, my dad now likes to get warm sometimes. Isn't that weird? That is most peculiar. <laughs> Life can be so surprising. Lots of love, me. Aww. And I got another email here from Alien Jeff. Hi QT3, way to go on planet... <laughs> I think I recommend to the factory that they wait a little longer before totally scrapping you. No, don't thank me. It's my pleasure. <laughs> if you uh, didn't know what the, the overall story of this game is, it's very simple. Um, yeah, you don't really have to watch all the episodes. You can jump in and out whenever you want. Basically, um, I am a robot. I got taken away from my family and my type of robot is being discontinued. And uh, to save my my robot kind, I guess, this model of robot, I need to prove my humanity. And the only way to prove your humanity is to go around to loads of different wacky planets and do weird quests for people. Just go along with it, don't question it, don't look too deep into it, just just go along and have fun. Just go along with the fact that I'm a robot cat riding a poo through space, because why not? <laughs> I think I'm going to have another sandwich today, and I don't mean I'm just going to stop recording and go eat a sandwich, I mean I'm going to have a planet sandwich where I'm going to do a personality quiz, and uh, then I'm going to go to visit a planet. And then I'm going to do another personality quiz at the end. Get some nice variety. Which one in this scene is more like you? Okay, am I doing the sweeping? Considering how incredibly messy I am? I don't think so. Uh, there's a guy there who just seems to be working hard. This guy is just chatting, having a laugh, not doing any work at all. Um, <laughs> I can relate to him a little bit. And this guy just seems to be struggling. He's trying to get the computer to work. He's trying to reboot it. He's got pop-ups coming up. He's got some viruses. He has no idea what he's doing. He's never seen a computer in his life. He's, he's trying to put ink into it. He typed something. He did it wrong. He tried to tip exit out. He's not having a good day. I think I'm this guy. I think I'm the guy just sort of quietly working, trying to create something good. Uh, without thinking, pick one. Grenade, baby, woman with a bottle, I pick... Woman with a bottle for some reason, I don't know why, that was just my impulse. Which animated web video would you click on? Um, <laughs> two men pushing a box back and forth as a guy eats a burger on top? Or... That. That thing. This looks a bit more exciting and mis <laughs> mysterious, I guess, so I guess I'm gonna go for that one. The candle says, Hi, I'm cold, can I come in? What should you say? Okay, but just for a few minutes. Sorry, not a good idea. Sure, come in. Just for a few minutes. I want to be kind and let them in, but I don't want my house to melt, so I'm going to go for that one. You are the judge. Which should win the crazy hat contest? Um, <laughs> a cat with a baby on, uh, a guy making a rabbit come out, or a fellow with ballistic squid in his head. I think that one, just because it's... It's, it's kind of the, the person wearing the hat rather than the other way around. That one seems to be the most quirky. This is what I've revealed about you. You feel impatient and antsy with re uh, reality. You are naturally intu intuitive. Uh, you can't read though. And see innovation and newness. Uh, you like stories set in the distant past or future. Change is exciting. You are responsible and have a strong worth ethic. I think that's true. I can tell that's from the, the one with the three people in the uh, the computers why it came up with that decision. Anyway, let's go to a new planet. Uh, I could go to New Hawaii. Hawaii? Should we go, should we go to this place? What do you reckon? Uh, I'm on the fence about it. Do I want to go here? Is this where I want to spend my time today? Yes, let's go here. I've traveled this far. I might as well hop on down. I do want a, a nice pretty one. I've still got distant memories of the planet. Yuck. If you didn't see that video, I don't recommend it. Don't go back to watch it. Certainly while you're having your dinner. It's very disgusting. 
Anyway, Alien Jeff, how are you doing? Welcome to New Hawaii. You'd think life would be a breeze in a place like this, but it's hard to be happy when you don't follow your dreams. You know what dreams are, right? Yes, they are something like this. <laughs> um, not those kind of dreams. Well, let's see what you can learn here. Good luck! Well, look, we got uh, we got a few hula girls and a hula fella dressed up as a bunny. Come on, move those hips! <laughs> right, let's go. Let's go travel across the uh, the land and let's go gather up all of my presents if I can. We can also go and look at some of the uh, the locals. It says there's only six missions for me to do here in total. So um, who knows? Maybe I'll finish it in this video. I know I've wasted over five minutes already just <laughs> faffing around and stuff. Here's the big sign saying New Hawaii. This one would actually be um, another one that would be pretty cool for the background of my home planet. There was the, um, was it Bunnipy? I think is the one I wanted, which was the candy one. And hello, Mr. Muscle Man. Look at those muscles. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, they're having a strong. Oh, look at him go. What a brute. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, there was the background from Bunnipy I wanted, which was all candy. But I, there's one mission. Well, I think there's a few missions, actually, I need to complete there. But in order to complete them, I need a colourful ice cream. And I'm not sure where I find that. So I'm going to have to go back to that a little bit later on. Anyway, one of the uh, the bodybuilders down here uh, seemed to be wanting some assistance. Maybe he wants some trimmers to, um, <laughs> to trim some of those curly hairs on his chest. Oh, look at those muscles. What a man. What a man. Hey, are you here to win my manly respect? Um, that's weird. Uh, sure, I guess. Winchester's manly respect. We'll see about that. Oh, do you reckon I need to, do you reckon I need to, to shake, shake my controller? Oh, no, maybe not. Uh, to help you with your problem, to admire your muscles, to work out with you, I'm gonna work out with the manly guys. I'm a team player. We're all gonna work out together. And by the end of this video, I'm gonna look like them. I'm ready to work out. Here we go. Oh, we're gonna start doing. Oh, here we go. Up we go. Up we go. Is that it? Come on, keep going, keep going. Focus, star jump. Come on, feel the burn. Feel the burn. Come on, you can do more than that. No, you can't do more than that. No, all done. Nicely done. You got spunk. I'll give you that. He's very impressed with me. <laughs> what do you say, Mustachio? Shall we see what this little person is made of? Yeah, let's see if you can lift this. Okay, I'll try. Right, let's try and do it right. Go, 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 go. Oh, look at me go. Easy. Look, why am I holding it like a baby? Then I hold it like a telephone. <laughs> you can tell I don't lift weights very often. Not too shabby. Now try to pump it. Right, let's go and pump it. Right, you can probably hear my analog stick going like crazy. I'm pumping my analog stick. <laughs> there we go. Does that count? Nicely done. He's very impressed. Doesn't take much. I guess you're cool. You can hang with me. There we go. Chester's my friend now. And I got a few grubs from it as well. Uh, it looks like he's got uh, another mission for me. Oh, he's got a present for me. What's he going to give me? I have something for you. I hope you like it. I got a guy on a basketball. <gasps> my dream come true. Has this guy got anything to say to me? Let's see what, um, was it, was it Mustachio? I think he was called. <laughs> my friend Chester here is being stubborn. Maybe you could talk to him. Um, sure. You mean this guy with the hairy chest? Uh, yeah, duh. Who else? Um, okay, let's go, let's go speak to him. Let's go solve his problems. Now that, um, uh, one of the guys, what's the problem? Well, we're kind of both in love with Hula Lula. <laughs> How can I help? Can you go and talk to her for us? Yeah, would you please? I guess I could give it a shot. Hooray! Uh, phew, yeah, we we'll wait here. Yeah, we we'll wait here. You go speak to Hula Lula. <laughs> oh, there we go. They're, they're both very hopeful that I'm going to be able to solve this uh, this difficult love triangle. So where is this uh, Hula Lula then? Which one do you reckon she is? There's a, there a few Hula girls when I entered. God, they're quite far away, aren't they? I think I want the long way around. Here's her. Oh, sorry, love. Didn't mean to trip you over. Oh, cheer up. It's not all that bad. Go and sort your hair out. <laughs> um, that's the worst hula that I've ever seen. Your people make me sick. Hi, Hula Lula. You got a minute. Basically, no. Oh, God. Sorry, love. I just said hello. Oh. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Mission fell to speak to again. Excuse me, Hula Lula. I want to speak to you. Well, what is it? It's about Chester and Mustachio. Not interested. Go away. What if I conjured something magical? Would you talk to me then? Ha! 
You can't do magic! I can too. What would you like me to make? <laughs> okay, fine. Make some sort of evil demon for me. A demon? Why? <laughs> While Mr. Happy is terrified of demons. <laughs> <clears throat> <laughs> uh, Mr. Happy doesn't like demons. I figure maybe this might motivate him to pay attention in class. Oh, great. Thanks a lot, robot. <sighs> okay, a demon it is. Be sure to make it a big scary one. Oh, God, she just pulled her hair off. With fire and horns and stuff. Unless you can't do it, that is. I can do it. I'll believe it when I see it. Okay, let's conjure up a big old scary demon. I feel I feel sorry for an old little for old, the little bunny fella down there because he's not paying attention in class, you see. Right, do, do I have one? Do I have a big demon? Oh, down here. Oh, look at him. Whoa, he looks pretty cheery. Let's spawn this guy in. I think there's a few other demons. Wow, terrifying. Fire! Wow, look at that. You actually did it. Would you look at that? Told you. Conjured a big scary demon with horns and stuff. I am Buzzbub the Demon! Ooh. Why have I been called forth? Uh, sorry demon, go back to sleep. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty mellow. Chill out demon, it's all good. Sorry demon, go back to sleep. Great, now you tell me. Once I'm up I can never go back to sleep. Oh, okay, I am sorry about that. Don't be upset, okay? Well, I am a demon. We kind of get upset. It's what we do. Oh, right. Life just gets better and better around here. <sighs> Sorry about that, Mr. Happy. Hula Lula, will you agree to talk to Chester and Mustachio now? Ooh, yay! Okay, fine. I'll talk to Chester. Send him over. I don't do much good here. <laughs> oh, there we go. At least I impressed the day. The demon's not happy because he was woken up. She doesn't want to speak to Chester, really. And Mr. Happy, well, gah, he's not living up to his name, is he? Well, let's go back to Chester. And hopefully, at least Chester's going to be happy. If no one else, hopefully, at least Chester's going to be happy that uh, she's go he's going to be able to speak to Hula Lula. But Mustachio isn't. Chester might be happy, but poor Mustachio. He likes Hula Lula, too. Chester, Mustachio, I have news. Hula Lula said she would talk with you. Hey, I know about that, Mustachio. How about that, Mustachio? Oh. Awesomely awesome. Now what? Go, go over and say hello. Go say how you doing. Aren't you going to talk to her? What if she doesn't like me? Oh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Do some push-ups just to just to chill out. <laughs> really? I need I need to make him confident then, I guess. Go on, Chester. You can do it. Yes, I am going to talk to Hula Lula. Wanna come watch me? Sure. I guess so. Oh, right. Well, here I go then. Do you reckon he's actually going to do it? Wish me luck. He seems to be stalling quite a lot. Uh, well, actually, I said I was going to go watch him, so I'm going to go follow him over here. And uh, then I'll, I'll go back to, to Mustachio. I think this is the quicker way to walk to him. <laughs> Good luck, Chester. Uh, Hula? Huh? Oh, it's you, uh, Chest Hair. Chester, my name is Chester. Whatever. I'm busy. What do you want? Uh, I was, uh, uh, I was thinking that uh, me and, uh, you, if, if you want to, uh, we, if you're not too busy, that is, um, what? Um, I mean, uh, maybe you could, um, maybe, maybe I could join your Hula class. Really? Of course, I'd love to teach you. Oh, that's, that's, um, that's great. There we go. It's not, it's not the outcome he was particularly after, but at least uh, he's going to get some time to, to be able to speak to her. <laughs> look at, oh, look at him dancing. <laughs> oh, makes, a, makes a change from, from weightlifting. Well, let's go to Mustachio then. I feel kind of bad because he's kind of, he's left, he, like he's lost his partner, his little weightlifting partner, and he didn't get the girl. I wish I had another friend. I mean, like Chester. But he's off dancing and stuff. Doesn't really understand my dream. What's your dream? To help the people of this planet with massive powerful robots. 
he wants fighting. I'm a robot. I could I could do a bit of fighting. The old one two, the old kapow, and that would help people. How does it matter? They're just so cool. If I could only find a friend that loves robots. Find someone who loves robots for mustache. Yeah, well, let's have a look at my pocket. Let's see if I got a friend who loves robots. Um, how do I know? What about what about her? She looks she looks like she's kind of dressed up like a robot. I do have a robot is another option. Let's give this lady and see if see, see if she gets along. Hey, hoo, hoo, hoo. I think I'm in love. You're so pretty. Oh, he likes pretty girls. That's why he's after the hula lula. Oi, oi, come back here. Oi, come back here. I love you. Right, let's see. <laughs> let's get my present for him, shall we? Here is a special something. Yay! A fat man in a hammock. How did he know? A hammock? A hammock? Let's go speak to Mr. Happy. Let's try and make Mr. Happy actually happy, shall we? I'm sick of this demon hanging around. If only I could finally start the N-H-A-D-R-D-L. Start the what? The new Hawaiian Anti-Demon Robot Defense League. My dream is to rid the universe of demons using the awesome power of robots. He likes fighting robots. For a place called Hawaii, I didn't realize they'd be so into robots. But I can't do it alone. I need a co-founder. We can finally get rid of that awful demon. Hey, I'm not that bad. I'm just misunderstood. Uh, so we need... What's, what's he want? Some sort of robot? Should I just give him a robot? See if that makes him happy. Do you want a robot? I got a robot. Do you want a robot, Mr. Happy? Do you want a robot make Mr. Happy happy? A deadly robot. Cool, I like those. Hey, and he's got a present for me as well. I'm doing good here. Okay, lots of presents. Sound, <laughs> sounds like I'm losing my voice. Did you hear me then? I was like, I'm doing good here. <laughs> oh dear. He's trying to do all these silly voices. Right. Who, who else wants help then? I got three more minutes. Mustachio needs to find someone who loves robots. Oh, I didn't complete his mission. I, I thought he was happy. How can I find someone who likes robots as much as him? Let's speak to him again. Mustachio, I found a perfect new friend for you. <gasps> Mr. Happy, of course, Mr. Happy. Why didn't I think of that before? Who did? Yeah, Mr. Happy wants to start a robot club. He just needs a co-founder. Really? That sounds awesome. Oh, look at him go. Look at his little legs. Go, go, go. Do you want a hand? I I'll help you out. Woo! There we go. I'll get you over there a little bit quicker. <laughs> what a fun game this is. Right, go a little bit further. Oops, sorry, mate. A little bit further than that still. At least he enjoys it. At least he's happy. Right, a little bit further. Oops, sorry, buddy. Right, if I just lift him and lift him all the way over here and place him and then oops, splatter him even. Uh, where where's Mr. Happy gone? Mr. Okay, I guess he's just running after him anyway. Let's follow along and see how this turns out. Mr. Happy, I found you a friend. Hey, dude. Hi, Mustachio. I heard you like robots as much as me. Who knew? Let's us let's have the first meeting of the N H A D R D L commence. Yay! Well, Mr. Happy's finally happy. Mustachio's still not completely happy. He still he still wants to speak to me. Hey, thanks for helping me and Mr. Happy. Yeah, I can't wait for our fighting robots. Nobody asked me about that. Now we need to find our first fighting robot. Hey, no more. We need to get a fighting robot then, eh? Right, let's get some speaking on Mustachio. Let's look in my pockets. Uh, well, there's this guy. I've already given him to Mr. Happy, but he looks out of the robots I had. Like, this guy doesn't look like a fighter. Actually, let's give him him. Let's see if this guy's a fighter. He is holding the peace symbols. I don't know whether he is. Here is your fighting robot. Wow, that will make a perfect first robot. Great thing, where is the demon? Oh, they're fighting the demon. No demons around here. Maybe I'll go for a little walk. Come back here, Mr. Demon, so I may be better and destroy you. Woohoo! <laughs> Yay, have I done it? Have I completed everything? Jeff's come down. I have returned. Did you miss me? Uh, I always miss you, alien Jeff. There we go, I'm warmly expressive. I always... Oh, God, wrong voice. I always miss you, Alien Jeff. Hmm, is that sarcasm? What sarcasm? Oh, right. That's... What was I thinking? Anyway, what did you learn about humanity? That you should never hesitate to live your dreams. And... Someone right next to you might share your dream. And...
And warm weather makes people crazy. And um, Alien Jeff is the best alien. Yes. In the entire universe. Hmm. You've learned some good things after all. Good. Well, I'll be keeping my three eyes on you. Bye, Alien Jeff. Bye. Still says I got one more mission. One goal not yet discovered. Um, I've not spoke to this little girl yet, have I? Let's go speak to her. Yay! Thank goodness. That should keep my demon busy. What's what's going on? Um, okay, let's go. Do, do you need a do you need a hand, love? <laughs> Have you ever hulled before? Uh, I'm programmed to hula perfectly. Let's let's ask to um. Let's just say um. No, let's ask to get taught then. Then I can do a little bit of a hula. Can you teach me? Well, we'll see. I can try. Let's give a little hula. Shake those hips. Oh, look at my little leg go. Oh, no. That wasn't any good. <laughs> that wasn't any good. Um, um, <clears throat> embarrassing. <laughs> what did you think about that class? I thought it was a nice try. <laughs> this is you. <laughs> oh, no one was very happy with me. Uh, let us speak again, then. Let let's try and get a little bit better at hula, seeing as this is my last, uh, my last mission here. Uh, excuse me, hula lula. What is it? About the hula. Oh, so you want to challenge me? Is that it? Uh, no, not really. Hmm. I just... Okay, fine, it's on. You and me. Face hula lula in hula battle. Yay, hula lula, show off your stuff. <laughs> Alright, right, Mr. Happy? Oh, is this him dancing? What's going on? Okay, anyway, let's have the, the hula off. Right, let's do it good. Oh, I'm doing pretty well. Doing better than last time. I'm not falling flat on my face in the sand yet, so better than last time. Hmm, not bad. Oh, she's very impressed. But no one else can do this. Oh, I give it, I give it a run for my money. If I had a little skirt on, I'd be doing it just as good as you. Like, I'm a little teapot there. I did that. You can see um Chester in the back, chest hair in the background doing his doing his poses. Wow, look at that. Hmm. Well battled for an amateur. Yay, I impressed her. I completed all goals on this planet. New home planet background unlocked. I can have new Hawaii in the background. Thank you. Yay, hula lula totally won. Oh, it's nothing really. Okay, class, let's get back to practicing. Yay, I managed to complete the entire planet in one video. Uh, sadly, we have run out of time, so I can't have my... My uh, Doki Doki Universe sandwich like I promised at the beginning. Um, but yeah, don't worry. So I'll start the next video with a personality quiz anyway. Anyway, that's the end of this video here. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I want to thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you all later. Goodbye!